Thank you. It's an honor to be back in Sao Paulo with colleagues and friends, and a special honor to introduce Alexis Mour, who is the president of the ICC. For those who are not familiar with the world of international arbitration, um, it's important for me to emphasize how wonderful it is to have the president of the ICC here with us as the keynote speaker to, along with um, his fellow panelists, open this conference. After the ruins of World War I, it was the ICC that came to the fore to rebuild the system of international dispute resolution. It was the ICC, the representative hate, who after a conference in 1951 in Lisbon proposed to replace the 1923 and the 1927 Geneva Conventions for the enforcement of arbitral awards. It was with the leadership of the ICC that we now have the 1958 Convention on the Recognition and Enforcement of Awards and Agreements, the New York Convention, 157 contracting states, and the most important and successful treaty in international trade. And I think many of us have forgotten that we have it thanks to the ICC. And now, when we are facing a new world order, the fourth industrial revolution, and this new era that is upon us, it is again the ICC, under the leadership of President Alexei Moore, that we see new and important changes. Whether it is working on transparency, working on diversity, broadening the arbitrator pool, looking into costs, and many, many more efforts that Alexei has embarked upon with his colleagues. Alex and Anna and Kathy, you have a wonderful team. We're so impressed, the entire community, including Professor Martin Hunter, who is here with the work that you're doing, and it's an honor to welcome you to take place on the stage. Ladies and gentlemen, Alexi Moore. Yeah. <laughs>